Hi, Matthew Holmes here from Clear Health Media. What we're going to do today is we're just going to quickly run through how you can add medical condition uh, markup from schema.org very quickly and easily to the articles that you're going to put on your website. <laughs> Hi, so what we're going to do today is just quickly run through how you use our uh, schema.org medical condition generator to actually very simply add the necessary markup to your articles to mark it out as a medical condition article. So first thing we need to do is we need to pop our content in the text box here. Now what I've done is I've used the content from the um, schema.org website just to sort of make it nice and easy. Uh, and Basically, the first thing you need to do is you need to wrap the entire content within a medical condition div. So that's the first option on the menu there. You just click Add. As you can see, it's added the schema thing at the very beginning there. Next thing we want to do is we want to add what's known as the name attribute. So we click on Name and then click Add. And you'd see it's added name to Stable Angina. Uh, and then what we can also do is we can use the angina pectoris here and we can put alternate name in there okay so you can then go on and you can start talking about you can put other markups in there such as um, cause so you know atherosclerosis and spas but spasms of the endocardial artery is one cause that's uh, attributed here um, and then you can go through and you can add things such as signs and symptoms, differential diagnoses, uh, different, uh, distinguishing signs, risk factors, possible treatments, primary prevention and secondary preventions um, and all those you do in exactly the same way you just go through you'd highlight um, this is a, a sign and symptom so let's pick that out and then we just click add and you can see it very quickly just puts the necessary information in. Now what you what you do is once you've finished you then just copy the information there and you just go and paste it onto your website uh, within you know whether you're using HTML or WordPress or something like that you should be able to just paste, paste your HTML in there and uh, that's really all that's necessary so I hope you find that useful uh, leave us some comments below that'd be wonderful and uh, you know if you think this is worth a link by all means pop a link on your website back to this generator we'd be really grateful thanks a lot